My name is Joan Whitson. And I'm Erica Bowserman. And we're with the Early Learning Coalition of North Florida. We all love playing with paint and getting our hands messy, right? Absolutely. But look, no hands. Ooh. Here are some razzle dazzle ideas to make paint scrape art using oh, oh, squeegees. squeegees. All right, some cardboard mm -hmm. coasters and some old gift cards or even like a little card you get in the yes, mail. Yes, all things we can reuse. And these you can cut out of paper plates and I even cut a scraper out of a cereal box. So let's begin by putting some drops of paint on this oval shape, but you can use any shape you want for your project. I love the colors you picked. I know, aren't they beautiful? Mm -hmm. So here I'm gonna use this scraper cut out of a paper plate. So with my helping hand, I'm gonna hold it and then I'm gonna scrape Ooh, Ooh, oh my gosh. down. Now you still have excess paint uh -huh. on here. So I'm going to come, oh! Oh, look at that. And oh, I might my goodness. wanna do one more, so the I'll turn it. colors are blending it. well. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, wow, that is now, beautiful. Now look at this, but you might only wanna go across two or three times mm -hmm. with the kids, because otherwise, you get mud paint. Yeah, okay? I can see how that would be, and just be too not much. you want mud paint. So you can choose to do as many colors as you like as I have here, or you can just pick two or three colors, mm -hmm. and then you can glue it on to colored paper for a nice background. Oh, that'd be great for your decoration in the classroom or at home. Oh, absolutely. That'd be beautiful. Absolutely, and shimmer paint works really good. <laughs> we love shimmer paint. Okay. You know, you can also just take a white piece of paper and again, put a lots of different drops mm -hmm. of paint on there. And this is where you get to use the scraper. Woo! And watch, I hope you can see this I'm... on the video. I got one oh, scrape. Josh, oh, Josh! Oh, look at, I see paint. all the extras. No, watch, now I'm gonna go down this. Oh, oh my gosh, oh, look oh, at, oh, look at, you oh. have to see how pretty oh, this is turning out. And then one. I'm gonna do one more. I'm Ooh. gonna go, cause this is like a blank spot. So try yeah. that. And oh, three. Oh Josh. my gosh, look at. Oh, and it's glittering. That looks so now, good. Now look at what if you cut that then, and look at how pretty. <gasps> if you cut that into a flower shape, yep. and then glue a little pom pom on there, glue it onto some paper like this. Wouldn't this make the nicest Mother's Day card um, or a, cla a flower mirror for your classroom? Yep, you could just put the flowers around the room and attach a little green stem to each oh, one. Oh, I think that would be fantastic. You could also just scrape lines, and you know on the paper individually to make stripes. That's, you know, that turns yeah. out really cool. Yeah. Oh, and show us the swirling pattern. Okay, so the swirling pattern, I did it this way. It makes really cool colors. I took my paper plate one, and what you do, because this is more flexible, mm -hmm. you to put a dot of paint and then you go around and you add another dot of paint and you keep going. And then you can use another scraper with another dot of paint. And then if you want to have the swirly pattern, or you can block it off. No, I love have, this. And you can have your rainbow. Oh, rainbow. And you can rainbow on both sides if you want to. It comes out really nice. So you have your rainbow there. So bring this colorful scrape painting mm -hmm. to life with quick, quick slow, slow light, light and hard, hard scrapes. scrapes. It is a simple art process that allows kids to freely explore and play. We hope you'll try these activities at home or in the classroom. And if they get really good at squeegeeing, you can use this on. Have them do your windows while you're doing your spring cleaning. Squeegee! I love it. Bye! Bye.